Hi everyone, this is Jay from Technic Solutions. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we will look at how to generate backup in the backup feature of Snipe IT. Some users reported that issue there. When they click on generate backup, then it gives an error. Issue was with the temp folder permissions and DB dump path. So we will look at how to fix this error and make generate backup feature work. Maybe in a future video, we will look at how to use the file we are backing up in this video to recover Snipe IT. So as you can see now at the moment, I have logged in um, to my server. So I spinned up two VMs, so AMS01 and AMS03. So AMS01 has um, Snipe IT where backup feature is working. So AMS03 has an issue with the backup. So let's have a look. So 50.2 is AMS uh, 01. So at the moment I have debugged feature turned on. So this is why you see this red bar and at the bottom uh, we can see logs and stuff. Okay. So you can turn that feature on. So it's in .env file. So you have to change um, from false to true or true to false. Either way if you want to turn app debug mode. All right, so once you log in and click on the right hand side, top right hand side, the settings, and then you go to uh, backup feature. So as you can see, I have already made a backup earlier. So if I click on generate backup, um, so it's going to generate a new backup file for me. So I just clicked on generate backup. And as you can see, it has just created a new file for me. Okay, so you can delete as well the old backups. I'm going to delete one of them. So this feature is working perfectly fine. So if I go back to AMS 03 and I'll click on settings and I'll go to backups. And here, if I click on generate backup, and as you can see, it gives me an error backup failed because the dump process failed with exit code one. It says general error. So documentation from Snipe IT, when I set it up, I looked up the documentation, I looked up Windows IAS and it does not show me anywhere um, to fix this permission or to fix that uh, problem in question. So um, to fix that, so first of all, I will log into AMS03. So first of all, we will find out DB dump path. So usually one would think the dump path in local disk C and um, program files, MariaDB, and then in bin, you'll find MySQL um, dump.exe. So would be here somewhere. So here's the MySQL dump.exe. So this path, one would think that's a path, but that's not actual path. To find a path, what we'll do is, in command prompt, we will run this command. And in this command, what you have to do is here, put the, uh, the path of your bin folder, okay? So in my case, the path was this, which is uh, C program files, MariaDB 10.0 backward slash bin, okay? So put that uh, path in here, that command is given in the description, I copy that command and open uh, command prompt and paste it here and hit enter. So it will give you that path. So that path is actually path. I'm going to copy this. So this is the path of DB dump. So now we will go back to our Snipe IT root folder, inet pub, www root, and um, Snipe IT, and here .env file. So right click and edit this with notepad. And in here, as you can see, DB dump path was C program files this, okay? So I am going to delete this and I'm gonna paste the new path. The only problem here is, or change here is, we have to use two backslashes. So anywhere there's one slash, backslash, so we use two backward slashes. So two backward slashes uh, with single quotations. Uh, just save it. So this is saved and I'm going to close this. Now we will fix the permissions of the temp folder in local disk C. Um, in Windows, we have temp, temp, and right click, properties, and security. Here you will see we do not have IUSRS. Okay, so we'll click on edit, add, 
and we are going to add IIS underscore IU SRS and check names you will see this and click on OK so this one we provide them uh, modify permissions and hit apply yes OK OK all right so this part is done as well so the next part is we are going to clear configuration cache to do that we'll go to inetpub www root in snipe it go to click file open command prompt and run it as administrator okay so here we are going to type php artisan config colon cache okay and hit enter so it says configuration cached um, cleared that's good so the last part is we'll restart our IS server so go to IS um, so IS manager and select the server and just click restart so it has restarted that so I'll minimize this I'll go back here where 60.2 is AMS 3 so I'll sign out and I log back in I'm signed in so we click on settings top right and then click on backups and then click on generate backup so it gave me an error of access denied so what I would like to double check is I'll go to local disk C and then let's go to uh, snipe IT root folder and in snipe IT click on storage right click and check properties of storage um, security so I I USRs users um, they do not have actually modify permission here so I will edit that and I will check on IAS USR users so I'm gonna check on modify and hit apply okay okay so they have modify permission now so I'll go back here I'm gonna refresh this page and click on generate backup here we are so the backup feature is now working so thanks for watching this video and uh, if you feel like this video was informative for you give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you have not done yet thank you